how do you welcome little girls and boys? Why am I asking my man at doing this? Anyway, this is where we start. Rip these. Let's just out of their packaging. Just rip, 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 rip. And take them out. We're gonna need lashes. We're gonna need tweezers. We're gonna need glue and honey. That is all. We're also gonna need your lashes. Make sure that you have eyes. We're gonna need your eyes. In particular, if you don't have lashes, it's okay. Now, you may see this pink tweezer. Uh, and you think it's cute. My dear, keep away from it. It's not the one we need. We need the simplest tweezer <laughs> there is. I bought that pink one first because it was pink. You know? Hello. And then it showed me that, you know, sometimes color is not the reason why we get us off. Peppers, because. So, yes, that is the glue we're going to be using. I'll go into detail a bit later about what we're using here. So, what you're going to do, you're going to find a little piece of paper or that thing that was packaging your lashes. You're going to put a bit of glue in it so that you can just dunk your lashes in there when you're using them. So, I normally start off by plugging out my lashes and then that is when I'll go into the process of taking them, not my lashes, the lashes that I bought, okay, the falsies. I plug out the falsies from their container, their packaging, and then so that it's just easy to grab and, and, and glue on. So that is me dunking them in the... I think dunking make it sounds like I need mean, to put on a lot, a lot of glue, but that's not what I mean. Just need a bit of it, just enough to make sure that when you put it there, um, they do stick. So one thing you're gonna notice is when you first try to put the lash, it might act up because the glue hasn't, isn't um, at its setting. It's called some pressure. I don't know. It hasn't. It hasn't set enough. But as you go on, it's just going to be so easy for them to get easily glued to your eye lid uh, because now the glue is is set to some extent. So it's just easy to dunk and then just put on your on your eyelid. I put mine under my my. And then my natural lashes, I also try to line them up. Here, as you can see, I'm doing my first eye. And it's just very simple. These weren't that longer than my own natural. Um, these were 12 mm. I think you can just see the difference between them and my natural. It isn't that much. So yeah, there's that. And then you just, I normally, after I have just put one up i also close my eyes just to give it a bit of pressure you see so that um it does stick so it's really that simple um so yeah you just keep doing that over and over again and you put more if you want it to be more voluminous or you want it to be uh a bit fuller you put you keep putting more but you just make sure that it looks neat and it looks nice and it's not irritating the nice thing about being able to do it for yourself is the idea that if the falsy falls out you can simply put it back i agree you know this now now you are a pro at this thing so now when i get sure imagine how much i've been paying to get this done now i can do it myself guys wait till i know how to plate my hair <laughs> So by lit. And as you, uh, after you have put them in, you just take the, the cute one <laughs> to put them in place. And there you go, child. Hey, lives, and welcome to my YouTube channel. My sister Guy here. If you are clicking for the first time, I have you welcome. And if you are a returning subby, thank you so much for being here again, adore. Um, today, as you've seen from the title, I just recently learned how to do my lashes. So I just wanted to share with you guys because there are a couple of things that I noticed. I thought it was a headache, but then I noticed if only I just had those specific things, it could work out. Simple thing. Make sure that the tweezer you're using is literally the one that looks like this. Literally. Because I bought this one because it was cute. I mean, it's pink. So, <laughs> I bought it because it was cute, but then I realized cute wasn't cutting it. This one is just good enough for fixing once you're done. 
this one is the one that you need for application so i also bought lashes <laughs> i know they're not here because i've already started using them and lashes too you can just get these from uh any chinese store or drugstore that you can find they come from this let me try to make it make sense for you and i don't know what it looks like that yep and then what you need is a glue that can hold them down okay this is a adderall professional lash tight for individual lashes okay it's a bad adhesive and yeah this is to keep the bottle tightly kept and that's what i try to do i've already since i've already done half of this i have a bit of glue in here um so we're gonna go into this one on the left is my falsies on the right natural lashes look at her all right so we're going on to the other eye this was probably the actual left eye but since we're dealing with a mirror image here it's gonna be on your right but it's the left eye that is why i was having difficulty something about this eye but you know what i've noticed as much as the left eye is a bit challenging it's not really the one that comes out looking very nice like it's my best job my best job is with my left eye at this point you are just merely repeating everything else that i've already shared you get to do hear me out this is not a lengthy process it, I, the only reason why we're at seven minutes at this point it's because i am talking it's not lengthy like that in at least five minutes we are done with this thing i'm kidding five minutes is nearly pushing it at least 10 to 15 minutes we are done and they come out looking nice let's go through this you're gonna take out your lash you're gonna get a bit of glue with it and then they, there you go guys can you just see how easy this thing is like i don't even get why i used to take hours with my lash tag if this is just how easily this is done I can't believe it. It's like I'm dreaming. Dream come true even. Not even complaining about this dream. I love this dream. So you're gonna need a mirror so you can like be close up and stuff. So that's what you do. Remember I said this cute one had a purpose? Yep, that's that's what it does. That is it. That is it showing off. Yes. It's and that is the rest of the tutorial. I just did that little wingy thingy. Like I said, if you want it to be more voluminous, you keep adding. I didn't even use the entire packet. Guys, this is the end result. Thank you so much for watching. Can you like and subscribe?